Hoosiers honor their four seniors after Saturday night's game against the Iowa Hawkins. One of those seniors, Captain Kaitlin Cox, may not be the most physically imposing player on the court, but she more than makes up with it with her passion and intensity. You know, honestly, I don't really think about it because growing up, I've um, been very lucky to play with taller people. One of my really good friends, she's actually six, six and a half, so, um, and I've been playing with her since I was 13, so um, I really don't think about it. You know, somebody could be seven feet tall, and I, and I mean, like Cody Zeller, I walk up to him and I'm just like, hey, Cody, you know, and I don't even think about how tall he is, but um, yeah, so it's not a big deal to me. When I asked Caitlin how she first began playing volleyball, she said her brother was her inspiration. Um, well, my brother grew up playing basketball. My dad worked at Ball State, and he was there around basketball and football. And then he changed sports to volleyball. And um, sorry, my voice. Um, and so I started going to practice with him. I think I was like six years old, and I started going to practice, and I got involved, and I would play with the girls and stuff, and I just fell in love with it. And um, you know, my mind hasn't changed since. I've quit every other sport for volleyball, and uh, I just stuck with it. You know, growing up at the Muncie program where I'm from, it's a it's um, a very well known and established program, and so I was very lucky to fall into that. So, knowing the type of team player that she is, Kaylin said she wants to be remembered more for the way she played the game rather than the numerous accolades she has achieved as a Hoosier. I think it's more the intensity and the passion, and you know what I my work ethic for how um, I've gotten the program to where it is. You know, this isn't hasn't been our ideal season. You know, last year we had such um, uh, a dream um, situation for this uh, program, and you know, coming off of that year and. Coming into this year, um, you know, it hasn't been the best, but um, our teammates keep fighting and, you know, I keep fighting every day and I hope um, just my passion and intensity and work ethic for the game is what I leave behind and people know me for. Um, not just her dig, you know, that she makes, but somebody gets a big kill or somebody gets a big block and, and she's just as excited for that. Um, and so to see somebody with that type of passion every single point, um, you know, we need more of those in our program. After the game, Coach Dunbar had some advice for Caitlin and the rest of the team as they approach the final four games of the season. Embrace every moment. You know, now that you get the monkey off your back of, of winning, you know, if you can embrace every moment and, and play and have fun together, you never get this time back. You know, so as much fun as you can have playing with your teammates that you love so much. And, and if we can find some more wins, that would be fantastic. But playing at a very high level and being very competitive and giving ourselves opportunities to win. Not ready to give up volleyball just yet. Kaylin says she plans on getting into coaching after she graduates in June. Right now, I'm just like so up in the air. You know, um, once this is over, I think I'll have an idea. I'll either really want to, you know, stay in it and coach, or I'll um, do my major and personal train and get into that kind of thing. But um, right now, I'm thinking that I'm going to coach just because my passion is there for the game, and I don't know if I'm ready to leave it quite yet. The game, a choked up Kaylin addressed the crowd. You know, I really um, commend you for um, sticking with, with us through this year. I know it's not what we intended on being, and you know, we fight every day, and I know you guys don't see it, but I know you believe it, and I appreciate that you stuck with us, and um, thank you for that, and thank you for my family, all of you, you, um, just through the hard times, the high times, and you know, the best of everything, and thanks to all the coaches for everything that you guys have done. And uh, I just want to tell everyone, you know, I appreciated my experience here at IU, and I wouldn't trade it for anything in the world. From University Gymnasium, I'm Harris Baker, IU Sportcom.